me. This 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 could be one of those events where absolutely no one shows up because. But on the other hand, this is no actually a lot of people showing up. For this. Take that back. That's okay, funny. hi everybody. I hi. am Blake Cabot. I am uh, the owner of FacePaint.com, and today we have a very special surprise guest. Uh, Jan uh, Kaler is going to be face painting Julie, um, and there's Julie. And uh, Julie, I met at Ace Convention, and I thought, you know, with those eyes, it just cries out for face painting, and and such a and, and you know, the strong silent type. That's the way I would describe Julie. Anyway, so uh, Jan, uh, take it away. Okay. Well, we met Julie in uh, Missouri at a festival. She was running away, so we rescued her, and. Um, she decided that she wanted to stay with us and help us with our face painting. So sometimes she manages our lines. Sometimes she helps hold our stencils. Um, mm -hmm. Sometimes she just kind of goofs off. But it's okay. She doesn't have to always work. No, no, that's right. Julie does enough. Julie <laughs> does enough. Um, so there's a lot of questions I have for Julie. But um, what are I guess the first one is, what are we painting her today? We are going to paint her. She said she wanted to be a Christmas princess. Of course. And uh, that makes an incredible amount of sense. Um, I think I think a Christmas princess is what we all want to be deep down. Deep down. Yeah. Okay. Um, okay, let's begin. Okay. All right, Miss Julie. I've got a really pretty Christmas palette here. Okay. Already. Do you like Christmas, Julie? And, you know, one of the things we've been mostly painting boards um, and people, but but they the boards sort of look like people. And we feel that the inanimate objects have not been getting enough, you know, uh, notice in the face painting community. And so that's why we're one of the many reasons. And we, we feel it's just sheer prejudice that we're we're not painting inflatable animals all the time. I Where mean, they get... it works so well. It does. It does. Okay. Looking so pretty. Uh, watch out for your hair in the way. Because, I mean, we want to see the expression on Julie's face because it's priceless. Yes. Of course. And this is part of Julie's journey. Julie, Julie, Julie's been to a lot of different places, um, a lot of different things, seen a lot of stuff, lot, and come through it with a real sense of humor. I mean, that's what I really, really like about Julie. Definitely, she uh, she is a real trooper. Yeah, absolutely. Um, and what's Julie getting for Christmas? Mm, that's a good question, Julie. What do you want for Christmas? She says she thinks she might want a puppy. Puppy, yes, of course. Because, and um, and I asked this earlier. Um, Julie's um, five years old. Yes. Yeah. Earth and, year. Earth years. Earth years. That's, yeah, that's right. Oh, man. Which I don't know. What does that translate into alien age? It is hard to say. It is hard to say. It depends on the planet, I would think. Um, what, what planet does Julie come from? Julie, what planet do you come from? This is a galaxy far, far away. <laughs> of course, of course. So when you're painting an alien, what's different from that, from painting a child? Well, you know, she's super still, like a lot of children are too, but I don't have to make her raise her head up. It's always right. there. Yeah, that's true. But you have to hold her head just like you do a child, although you don't hold them from the the, the claw, as someone described it, uh, oh. on top. <laughs> true that. Yeah. Okay. And Jan, how long have you been face painting? I've been at it for about 20 years. That seems like a while. It is. It is. The glitter. 
<laughs> yeah. <laughs> We're getting a mirror. I didn't have that ready. I forgot. Yeah. what she thinks and i know this is this world's been uh difficult and there's been a lot of various political developments it's, has um has she been uh have people been mean to her because she's purple mm, mean to her Julie, has anybody been mean to you <laughs> i think i saw your husband in the mirror she gets <laughs> she gets looks every once in a while and it does yeah. make her wonder but yeah. mostly everybody's just curious and wants to talk to her and see what's going on. Exactly. Exactly. Good. Good. You ready to see? Smile, she Julie. Absolutely loves it. <laughs> she feels like the biggest princess, she says. Awesome. Okay. Well, uh, are we doing another design on Julia, or is that we're 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 we're, we're finished? We can absolutely do another design. You let's do another design. Yeah, let's do another design. Something. Okay, we did a Christmas princess on Julie. Um, how about a? Uh, I don't know. Holly, that's always good. Um, what other good Christmas things are there? She's the gift that keeps on giving. So maybe. Uh, Christmas gift? I don't know. What well, for the people that are watching? Okay. What should we? What should we paint? Let's see what Q and A says. Um. Oh. Oh. They they're having a hard time seeing the design. Says Leslie. Ooh. Oh. Sorry, Leslie. Okay. We need to get somehow closer to to Julie. Okay. Or prop her up, maybe. There we go. There we go. That's perfect. That'll help. Um, let's see. What else can we paint on you, Miss Julie? Uh, uh we need How to add a Christmas butterfly. Christmas butterfly. Okay. There we go. All right. We might need to prop her head up a little bit. Okay, I can do that. Oh, and Holly was one one request. Holly. Okay, I can put a little Holly with that. Holly, Holly, I have a Holly princess. You want to do a Holly princess? Should do a Holly princess. Okay. You know that's the great thing about being a plastic alien, is that it really wipes off easily. This is true. Yeah. The face paint doesn't stick on very much. All right. Okay, perfect. And if anybody has any questions that they want to ask Julie, you know, uh, feel free, really. I think there's... There's a realm of things. I mean, how often do you get to talk to an alien? Right. She's got a lot of things she can say. Absolutely. Okay, there's the holly. There's a lot of glare on Julie's, what I would think of as nose. Does that feel better? Uh, no, it's still there. Um, let's try taking a light off. Maybe take one of the lights off, yeah. Right. you know she's a very shiny face that's the thing there we go that's better okay hmm 
You know, I would think with Julie, you'd want to use matte makeup because her face gets yeah. so shiny. Oh, um, that's probably a good idea. Yep. Uh, so question comes in, uh, does she tell you the colors that she likes te telepathically? Yes, she does. Yeah. Makes sense. Absolutely. That's just how she talks. Yeah. No, I mean, I, obviously I, well, why I waste time? super cool. It is. I mean, are, are those nostrils on her face or, or is that something else? Yes, those are nostrils. Okay, just checking. Because it could have been something else like, a, you know, lasers. <laughs> she doesn't have any lasers. Yeah, the reflection's a little difficult, I understand. But you just have to <laughs> imagine that you're an alien and we'll, we'll just make do. Okay. She says she loves it. She loves it. Okay, great. Okay. Now let's do a butterfly. Butterfly, you got it. She says that sounds good. She thinks you butterfly. Know, what, are I mean, what, what color scheme goes really well with purple skin? Um. Hmm. As long as what I'm using is not purple. Anything that, else seems to show up pretty well. Bright colors, yeah. though. Bright colors, I would think, because it's relatively dark purple. Right. Nicole thought that was super cute. Or maybe she <laughs> just thinks Julie's super cute. I mean, Julie is super cute. No question. <laughs> I agree. That's why we kept her. Yeah, makes sense. And she's always so willing to let me paint her whatever I want. Exactly. You know, all those fussy models who want to get paid. Jeez. Right. She doesn't Not talk Julie. back. She doesn't, you know, when she talks to me, it's telepathically. So she doesn't move. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> Now it's too dark. Somebody's saying it's too dark. It was too light. And if you put too much light on it, what happens is it gets shiny and then you can't see anything. And if you don't put any light on it, it's too dark and then you can't see anything. So it's, okay. we're damned if we're do, if we're damned if we're don't. Um, it's not Julie's fault. No. Is that any better? A little. I, mean, I can see what you're doing. You know, sometimes we do face painting for to show you guys fabulous art and great artists. And sometimes <laughs> we're just trying to make Julie happy. And this is one of those other times where we're making I Julie agree. happy. Yeah. And Julie loves an audience. So this is uh, this is a big part of it. Let's see where we can go with that. I can't see the, yeah, can't see the outside of Julie uh, on that side. Okay, there we go. <laughs> yep. So this is a, oh, what split split cake is that? That is something we kind of, we put all, it's neon, neon mm -hmm. rainbow. Okay. And this is a GTX thing, base paint? I can't say I know for sure. I think my mom makes them. I think she buys them 
individually and cuts them and makes her own. Gotcha. Okay. Tag, I think, is who she uses. Okay. Just make sure to... Right, it's hard to paint and not be in front of it, but... Oh, sorry, my bad. No worries. It's just a rainbow, yeah, Nicole. It is. And how is it different painting on Julie versus, let's say, uh, a human? It, um, the paints is a little slipperier. Like it, it, it it's, um, it's, you gotta really load your brush and let it, and so that you can see the paint. Yeah, absolutely. There's a great question from, uh, Barbara. Uh, yeah. what happens if Julie explodes? <laughs> Well, we haven't covered that yet, but you know, that yet. So I mean, I would be very sad. I, I'm sure that Julie would be even more sad. I mean, that that would that would that would, that would be really uh, awful. She has had a yeah. poke, and we've had to we've had to perform surgery and cover up her her um, her hole. Yeah, her injury. Exactly. <laughs> that would that would be it. Well, everybody, I, I, I think we can keep, uh, I, I think this is probably, we've done three designs, which is probably more than we've ever done in 17 minutes. But uh, <laughs> uh, I think, I think we've, uh, we, this is, this is pretty much it, but thank you. Thank you very much, Jan. Thank you, Julie. You uh, and uh, Merry Christmas to you all. And uh, Thanks Merry, for Christmas. Yeah, it's Merry Christmas. Yeah, absolutely. Okay. Goodbye, everybody. This has been a lot of fun. It was uh, oh, wait a minute. Here's a question. Do you normally use a brush to put the base on or a sponge on Julie? Mm, I hardly use sponges on anybody anymore. So brush. Huh. Exactly. Uh, uh, as as a uh, nice person on Facebook splits us as face painters, we bring joy to everyone that stands on our chair, no matter how far they're coming. Makes total sense to me. <laughs> on that extremely positive note, uh, thank you very much, Jad, and thank you very much, you all. See you guys in, in next year. Okay, bye-bye.